This is how quickly you can actually crack a password protected PDF. Now, don't think that these are secure. It's all depending on your password complexity, and that's why this is really important for user education and awareness. So I'm going to create a password protected file. So mine's called really important.pdf, and then the output is going to be a duplicate of that file, but with a password on it, so user underscore password, and then just one through to nine. Now it's on the desktop, so it's the password one is pwd.pdf, and that's what we're going to actually crack in this. So it's PDF to John. Oh, that's all you have to type is PDF to John. It's pre-built, installed in Kali Linux. PWD.pdf, and then this is generating the hash of that specific file, and then the hash is what is used as a, like a dictionary to attack. So now we've generated the hash file. The dot hash is just the extension. That's really important. The PDF is just a convenient name, so you could call that anything. But make sure the dot hash is the extension. Then all we need to do now is type John PDF dot hash, click enter, and it's done. You can see there we've got the password. And this is why pass password complexity is so important.